here at Noah's Caring Hands and kitten season is coming up and we have Robert Thomas and you are an emergency veterinary assistant. Correct, yes. You got a kitty with you. Yes, this is Arctic Ice. He is my girlfriend and I's cat at home. <laughs> And he's beautiful. Oh, very. He's a handsome man. And he's quiet because he's falling asleep because you're so nice and warm. Yes. Uh, here's a cat that's well taken care of, well cared for. Is he fixed too? He is, yes. Yeah, okay. he's fixed. Okay. Then it was done by Dr. Katz. Very good. Now, what we're... Dr. Katz, that's funny. Now, what we're going to talk about here is kitten season. There are way too many kittens mm -hmm. out there. Cats make kittens. That's one thing they do very right. well. Tell us about when does kitten season st start typically? So kitten season starts typically when the, war the weather becomes warm outside. You know, we start to see a lot of more action, especially with uh, feral cats out right, there. You right. know, they start to they start exploring and start expanding their boundaries a little bit more. So we become concerned with our feral cats mostly, but even our house pets at home, if you know, uh, once they're on the prowl, they can get outside and we can have a hard time finding them sometimes. And they uh, just, they want to get out there and kind of do their business and do their own thing sometimes. They're dating. They'd like to. Correct. <laughs> they like to get around. Correct. And that's why also when you spay and neuter your cat for a house cat, they become better pets. Don't Correct. They? They're not looking to run around. Oh, definitely. Yeah. They're, they're, they're more entitled to stay home. You know, they're not, they, they, they don't have that prowl anymore. They don't want to go outside and find them a mate. And so they're, they're more relaxed at home with you and your family. <laughs> He, uh, Arctic is touching the microphone. He wants to talk a little. Cat's got his tongue right now. Um, what age do you think is a good suggestion to have your cat fix, spay or neuter? Four to six months is when we like to start seeing spay and neutering in pets. Same time we're starting vaccinations with our pets at home as well. Mm -hmm. I don't think a lot of people realize that, and I just recently learned that, that at four months of age, a cat, a female, a queen can start having kittens. Correct, yep. Four months of four age. Four months of age, that young, and it can be in any, any time of the year. Yeah, that's another thing. Warmer, they tend to move more, but they can have kittens at any time Correct. of the year. Yeah, and they're n they don't discriminate. They can have uh, mate with anyone. Aunts, uncles, brothers, sisters, father, mother. Okay. There's the problem. Okay, the solution, spay and neuter, you get a better pet. Better for their health, too. Isn't Correct, it? better for their health. We want to make sure we're not uh, going anywhere towards pyometras, which are infections in their uterus and causing any kind of concerns. And we can see open and closed pyometras. So, oh. And that, a lot of the times, it involves surgery. Uh, it can be very life-threatening if not caught early. And expensive as well. And expensive as well. So there's the other thing. It, it's better to spay and neuter because it's better for the health of the pet and the health of your wallet. All right. Well, we'll let you go with your cat. All right. You're adorable, aren't you? Can, can I hold on of for course. just a second? I want to hold Arctic. I want to hold on to Arctic here. Oh, well, let me hold on to Arctic. Okay. He says I'm flipping around. There Arctic, we go. flip around. Okay, Arctic. Here. Oh, we'll be back with more. All righty. On Pet Pals TV. He's so warm. He's so warm.